Okay, so we've finally released some safety data on life jackets, and it's pretty shocking to say the least. It's been a year and a half of us coercing you into wearing life jackets through mandates and threats of unemployment and being banned from participating in society, as well as constant pressure to put on additional life jackets for your protection, all while reassuring you that life jackets are safe and effective. So effective that you can still drown while wearing one, and so safe that we've refused to release the safety data until now. Here's what's going on. After ignoring a Freedom of Information Act request to release safety and effectiveness data on life jackets, the Flotation Device Administration requested 75 years to release the 400,000 pages of docs to the public. Why would they request so long? Probably because they have nothing to hide. So they requested three quarters of a century to reveal that which they um, didn't need to hide, but definitely really wanted to. But in January of this year, a judge ordered the Flotation Device Administration to release the documents much faster than that. Specifically, the documents pertaining to their approval of life jackets. Specifically, the judge ordered them to release 10,000 pages on March 1st, we're about to go into those, and another 10,000 pages on April 1st, and 80,000 pages on May 2nd, 80,000 pages on June 1st, and another 80,000 pages on July 1st, 70,000 pages on August 1st, and then 55,000 pages per month on the first business day of each month after that. This is all after the first 500 pages were ordered to be released back in November of 2021. So gosh, what do the release pages reveal about safety data? Now that we pretend the Nuremberg Code doesn't exist and life jackets have been aggressively pushed for a year and a half, with over $37 billion in sales? Well, the first 500 pages from November didn't reveal much, just 1,200 deaths within 90 days of people putting life jackets on. But we should note, those 1,200 people who died from putting life jackets on were very well protected from drowning. So they better be grateful for our product. And moving on to the recent 10,000 pages of safety information on life jackets that the Flotation Device Administration didn't want to reveal, but were forced to reveal by a court. Now, again, they didn't show much. Just things like 1,246 medical conditions that occurred after the administering of life jackets, including inflammation of the heart, inflammation of the brain, facial paralysis, fetal distress syndrome, tachycardia, temporal lobe epilepsy, multi-system inflammatory syndrome in children, foaming at the mouth. Is that the same as rabies? Mm. Death neonatal, cardiogenic shock, cardiac arrest, cardiac failure, brainstem embolism, brainstem thrombosis, and a lot of others that I don't really know how to pronounce, so I don't think they count. And I also wish the Flotation Device Administration was able to keep them hidden. Safe and effective life jackets, ladies and gentlemen. But the good news is those who have been injured or killed by life jackets are prohibited from suing the manufacturers. So they don't really matter to us. Now, some experts say these revealings should put an immediate end to life jackets. But the experts who say that aren't on the payroll of the Flotation Device Administration or the life jacket manufacturers. So they're not really qualified to have an opinion here because they don't really get the full picture. And get this, some conspiracy theorists think these revealings are newsworthy and wonder why there's no mainstream media coverage of them. Well, there's a very simple explanation. I mean, you just kind of think about it and you know you consider everything and Look over there, it's World War III! Thank God for Russia. Plus, there's this consideration. Friday night on Aaron Burnett Out Front. Brought to you by Life Jackets. CBS Health Watch, sponsored by Life Jackets. Anderson Cooper 360. Brought to you by Life Jackets. Ha <laughs> ha What exciting safety data. And this is just the first 10,000 pages. Only 1 40th of what the Flotation Device Administration has, has been revealed so far. Now with 2.5%, I can't wait to see the other 97.5% of the full picture, which will probably also reveal nothing. 
but stay tuned, we'll see. In the meantime, with these new revealings, I just want you to know from my heart to yours, if you still question the safety and effectiveness of life jackets, you'll still be considered a lunatic domestic terrorist. Have a great day. Bye-bye. <laughs> mmm. I like the taste of freedom. And if you do too, you might enjoy my whole freedom line of merch as a way of helping spread freedom vibes around the world. Check it out at awakenwithjp.com. Ow, what do you want? It's so annoying. Oh, hi. I want to thank the sponsor of today's video, Blue Blocks, and the Blue Blocks Remedy Sleep Mask. I love the Remedy Sleep Mask because it empowers me to be as lazy as I want to be, helping me sleep soundly throughout the day while I should be being productive. Like, it is really hard to be lazy and sleep during the day because it's bright out. Like, there's the sun. That's why I love the Remedy Sleep Mask. Oh, and maybe you're not a lazy person who's pissing your life away, but it's important to you to sleep soundly, whether you need to nap during the day or sleep soundly at night. So whenever you're sleeping, in order to get ideal, optimal sleep, you gotta block out 100% of the light from your eyes, which can be hard to do even at night in your bedroom with alarm clocks and street lights coming in through the windows. So with its total darkness guarantee, the Remedy Sleep Mask is not only the solution for lazy people, it's also a solution for productive people. Unlike other sleep masks on the market, the Remedy Sleep Mask is armed with hollow eye pillows so there's no pressure on your eyes and it's fully adjustable. So even if you have an abnormally shaped skull like me, it'll still fit you perfectly and comfortably, ensuring you get a beautiful deep sleep. Being a new dad, I take naps when I can, and the Remedy Sleep Mask helps me maximize my sleep, and I always take it on the road with me when I'm on planes or in hotel rooms as well. If you want to start optimizing your sleep so you can feel and function your best with the Remedy Sleep Mask in Blue Blocks' full suite of blue light blocking glasses, then just go to blueblocks.com jp, and be sure to use the discount code jp for 15% off. Good, good night. Is that my alarm clock already? Ah!